Welcome to the Crypto Investments channel. In this video, I will talk about Decentraland price prediction and Decentraland news today. If you like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Write in the comments your price forecast for Decentraland in 2022. Decentraland Mana, defines itself as a virtual reality platform based on the Ethereum blockchain that allows users to create, serve and monetize content and applications. In this virtual reality, users buy land that they can later navigate, build on, and monetize. Decentraland was launched following a $24 million initial coin offering, ICO, that took place in 2017. Virtual World launched its closed beta in 2019 and opened to the public in February 2020. Since then, users have created a wide range of experiences on their land sites, including interactive games, extensive 3D scenes, and many other interactive experiences. Decentraland was created by Ariel Milik and Esteban Ordano, who have retired from their core roles on the project, but are still working with Decentraland as advisors. Five cents. The 61.8% retracement level for this move lay at $64.78, and it has been tested as a support level. Moreover, the $63.67 area, sign box, is an area of former supply, and Axis has likely flipped it to demand. The RSI climbed past neutral 50 once more as bullish momentum gathered, and the chicken money flow was at 0.06 to show significant buying pressure in the market. Adam formed a near-term range from $27.2 to $29.4, wait, and in the past few days, the price has attempted to break out of this range and succeeded. Moreover, it established a bullish shorter block in the $29.5 area, sign, which meant a revisit to this area, could present buying opportunities. There was also a zone of resistance in the $31 area, red box. The awesome oscillator crossed over above the zero line to show bullish momentum was rising once again, while the CVD also registered green bars to show demand was picking up. Mana was another coin that was retesting a former area of resistance as demand. At $2.7 and $2.54 rested areas where sellers had been strong in recent weeks. However, in the past week, the price formed a compression and broke out past both these areas. In the next couple of days, another move northward could be witnessed. While the MACD was dipping in response to the sharp pullback from $2.8, the OBV continued to form higher lows. The SMIN buying volume was steady and stronger than selling. Our taxi protocol, who almost lost all his Ethereum, ETH, in what he called a social engineering scam, shows how Web3 scams are perpetrated. It started with a user called Hackshine who reached out to Thomas.eth on Discord, showing their interest in Aero and offering to help. Hackshine then introduced Thomas to Lin, who is said to be passionate about tolls and working on a metaverse project. After multiple exchanges, Lin then mentioned that they launched their staking app and offered to send Thomas.eth two different non-fungible tokens, NFTs. Things then got tricky because while Thomas asked to have the NFT sent to his hot wallet, Lin wanted to send it to his primary wallet. When Thomas asked to read through the contract before the NFT were sent to his main wallet, Lin started getting pushy. Thomas then realized that the tokens he approved were not Armstrong ETH, but rather OV's ETH, and that on his main address, almost all of his ETH was sitting in OV. His saving grace was that he had opted to move the NFT to a new ETH address. He retested the $3,200 area as a zone of supply. Only in the past few days has ETH been able to push past the $3,200 area and retest it as a demand zone. Moreover, on the 4-hour chart, the RSI continued to show strong bullish momentum and was in overbought territory with a value of 73.6. The OBV was also rising and momentum could see Ethereum climb past $3,411. This would be yet another sign of near-term bullish strength. $3,650 $3,700 is the next resistance area. A set of Fibonacci retracement levels were drawn based on Axe's move from $58.55 to $74.80 nothing more than a joke. Heineken announced the launch in a press release on Thursday. Dubbed Heineken Silver, the beer will only be available at the company's Metaverse Brewery in Decentraland. Taking its joke further, Heineken invited several real journalists to witness the launch of its fake beer, later adding that guests received a treat of pixelated lobster and caviar at the launch event. According to the Bring Giant, the whole idea behind the virtual beer is to poke fun at us, and many other brands, that have jumped on the metaverse bandwagon. Describing the ingredients in Heineken Silver, the company said it is made out of the freshest pixels, no malt, no hops, no yeast, no water, and also, no beer. While having a virtual beer may come in handy in a gaming environment, Heineken believes that certain things are best enjoyed in real life, and brews are definitely one of them. Although Heineken has slammed its product with the title of the world's first metaverse beer, this is not the first time a beer manufacturer has entered the space. Miller Lite holds the honor of creating the first beer on the metaverse, having opened its Meta Lite bar last month. As to the bearish thesis, of buyers pushed the altcoin above the 200-day MA, the price could attempt to enter the triangle pattern, indicating the current breakdown was a bear trap. 
Currently, the mono price exchange is handed $2.38, with an intraday gain of 3.32%. Technical indicator the mono price trading below the daily mile INE 20, 50, 100, and 200 maintains a bearish tendency. Moreover, the sellers have recently reclaimed the 200 day MA, providing an extra edge to short sellers. The super trend indicator maintains a negative bias in the daily time frame chart. Despite a lower low formation in price action, the RSI indicator slope maintains its low at 40%. This indicates weakness in selling momentum, bolstering buyers to wrest control from them. Resistance level. How much will Decentraland cost in 2025, or how much will Decentraland cost in 10 years? Guessing price fluctuations and predicting future prices is a hell of a task. Decentraland Price Prediction 2022 It appears that by 2022, Decentraland, Mana, prices will hit a level similar to their previous all-time high. For 2022, we can expect the average rate to be $3.70. If everything goes smoothly, we predicted that Decentraland's maximum price could be up to $4.21 in 2022. Of course, there are chances that the market will fall after a long bull run, and this is normal for the cryptocurrency market. Decentraland Course Forecast 2023 Mana has great potential, with certain interactions and innovations, it is possible to increase the number of users in advertising. If the market focuses on investing in Decentraland, the price could rise much higher. By 2023, it may reach a maximum value of $6.18. Mana is expected to reverse slightly if the market goes down. The year 2023 could end with an average price of $5.37, a minimum price of $5.19, and a maximum price of $6.18. Decentraland Course Prediction 2024 In 2024, with wider adoption in partnerships between other important blockchain networks, Decentraland price will skyrocket. The maximum trading price could reach $9.01 in 2024. The price ranges will be very trendy if we stick to them. If all goes well, we can expect an average price of $8.04 with a maximum price of $9.01 for 2024. Price Mana Forecast 2025 For a long-term forecast of the Decentraland price, basic analysis is important. In terms of industry benefits, the native token offers several. The autonomy of the digital economy makes it ideal. As DAP and stablecoins evolve, the network offers competitive programmable payment, logistics, and storage options. There is a possibility that the average price of mana will rise to around $11.46 by 2025 if the idea attracts more investors. For 2025, the year could end with a maximum price of $13.49 with a minimum price. Level $11.13. Mana Rate Prediction 2026. Mana will be seen as the best option, and with a huge community, the Decentraland rate will reach new highs. Price swings are hard to predict, especially if the market is more bullish or bearish than ever. For the year 2026, the Decentraland rate will be almost $16.85. The maximum bet we can get is $20.02. Decentraland average price prediction for the end of 2026 could be around $17.30. A huge price turnover is expected in the range to